Hey guys, what's up? So this is my first video on how to quit dipping. I have videos on my progress of not dipping. Um, I have another video on some withdrawal symptoms. But I want to start another little series, mini-series, within a series, um, about how to quit. Okay? Um, my story is different than probably everybody else's. and Everybody's going to, you know, not all these tips are going to work for you. You're going to have to pick and choose and see what works for you. You know, who knows, maybe every tip works for you and that's great. Um, today, tip one, you have to want to quit. You have to really want it, okay? And I know a lot of you that have quit in the past, you just haven't been able to do it, and you are just simply just don't want to quit. You know, you don't want to. The, the risks, you know, don't outweigh the challenge, you know, of quitting. And understand that, I've been there. Um, I've tried to quit twice, and each day I made it like three days. And I just wanted to dip, you know, and then I, so I gave into the craving. You have to really, really want this. Quitting dipping is extremely hard. It's way harder to me than it was. I, I drank for seven years and I quit easily. I smoked for two and a half to three years. I quit that easy. This is no joke. Like, dipping is really tough. You're getting a large amount. It's just something about it. I don't know what it is, man. Um, just it's a large amount of nicotine going directly into your bloodstream very quick and it's very very addictive um, nothing like a big dip <laughs> but um, anyways I'm like getting all weird I'm, like craving it now but anyways um, so how to quit you have to want to quit that's the first step that's the first step to any addiction really you have to want it you have to want to here's the deal it is very hard to imagine your life without chewing tobacco at this point. If, you, if you're just starting, it's like, I can't imagine ever getting a dip again. What was I thinking before when I never had dip? Your brain has become addicted. It has rewired itself into thinking that you need this every day. This is something that's pleasurable. This is something that's great. I'm two weeks into this, and my brain's already changing back to the way it was before. I still have problems. I still have cravings every once in a while. But I'm, I can imagine my life without it because I've been living my life without it for two weeks, you know. So I'm starting to get back to normal, you know. I still crave a dip. I still It's still sometimes kind of hard to imagine. But you know what? I want to quit. I want to be like I was before. I don't want to be in shackles and chains, you know, to this addiction. And you can say all day long that, you know what, I just want to dip. You know, I just want to dip. I don't, I don't care about quitting or anything like that. You're you're just you're a prisoner to it, and that's what it is. That's the honest truth. It's just you're not admitting it. I was a prisoner to it, but the first you know the first step to it is you have to want to quit. And that's the bottom line. So that's my step one to this whole little series. Before I get into details about how to quit and how to make this easier for you, this is the first. This is the first thing you have to want it. You have to want to be the way you were before, and and until you figure that out, until you until you do that, it's going to be so hard, or it's going to basically be impossible to quit. You have to really want to be, you know, be clean off of that. So, anyways, I hope that's you know some words of encouragement. Um, I got to get out of here. I got plans today, so I'm going to make some more videos about this probably tonight and get them on here. But uh, anyways, rate, comment, subscribe. Like my video, subscribe to my channel. I got more videos on uh, alcohol, stress, and anxiety, ways to make money, just tips and advice about you know addictions and everything. So um, subscribe to my channel. Stay strong, guys. Bye.